What's up guys, in this video I have a new iOS 7 hidden feature video to show you guys, and this hidden feature works on the iPhone, the iPad, and the iPod Touch. Basically what it is, is you can actually control your device using simply head movements by turning your head to the left or the right. So I'll go ahead and jump right in here and show you guys how it works. You gotta go ahead and open up the settings app, open up general, go into accessibility, and if you scroll down here you'll see a new switch control in the physical and motor. So go ahead and click that, and basically you can add switches to control certain aspects of your device using the right head movement or your left head movement. So I actually have the app switcher configured here uh, with my left head movement, and I have to select an item selected with my right head movement. So I'll go ahead and turn on switch control here. And as you can see, a blue box comes up and starts scrolling. So I'll go ahead and turn off switch control because that wasn't supposed to pop up. Go ahead and turn switch control on again here. If I turn my head to the left, it will jump directly into the app switcher. As you guys can see there, I didn't even touch the screen or anything. And I can also go ahead and select an app by turning my head to the right, which is select an item. So I'll wait for that to actually pop up again. And as you can see, if I go into the left here, and I turn my head to the right, I can select the app and it'll go directly into the app without even touching the screen. And you can also configure new switches for almost anything. I'll go ahead and change this switch here. I'll add a new switch to control, let's say, Siri with my left head movement. Go ahead and turn it back on. If I turn my head to the left here, as you can see, it jumps right into Siri without even touching the screen or anything, which is pretty awesome. And essentially, you can do this with any of these uh, actual movements. I'll go ahead and delete this, add a new one. So let's say for the home button with my left head movement, movement if I turn this on and then turn my head to the left it will actually go directly to the home screen so as you can see that's how it works it is really cool actually in my opinion and I figured I'd share it with you guys because it is a hidden feature that many people didn't notice and it was posted online earlier this week and I think it actually is really cool so basically what you have to do is go into settings then general then accessibility and then scroll down to switch control and that's how you can control it you can also set different toggles to set up the speed of how fast the blue box scrolls and all that good stuff and overall I think this is a pretty cool hidden feature I'm not sure how much this will be used in terms of accessibility because most people will probably just prefer to touch the screen or the home button or something like that to access their apps or use the multi-touching but it is nice to see Apple is adding new accessibility features and this probably means that in the near future they'll be making it closer to the Xbox or the Wii where you can actually use different motion controls using either the camera, your head movements, turning your head side to side, or finger motions, or actual new gyroscope where you can move your device like so, and you can actually access new motion features. So it is very interesting to see Apple is adding new features like this, and I actually really enjoy it. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this feature, and for more content, be sure to rate, thumbs up, and favorite the video, as well as subscribe and stay tuned for more. Um, I do upload regular videos, so stay tuned for those. And for more up-to-date updates, which I upload, up, update regularly, excuse me, be sure to follow me on Twitter, my website, my Google Plus page, my Facebook page, and my vlog channel all in the description. And for more content as well, be sure to just follow me and check out my channel for more iOS and Apple content. And if you're interested in earning free rewards and free paid apps simply by trying free iOS or Android apps, go ahead and check out the link in the description. I will actually post it there so you guys can sign up for that. It's free and it works very well called Feature Points, and I use it a lot. And overall, hopefully you guys stay tuned for more videos, check out my channel for more videos, and always be sure to subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. So enjoy this feature, enjoy accessing your phone using head movements, and I will catch you later. Peace.